word, value, growth, fellowship, transformation. I present to you the word of God that prepares you onward, inward, upward, and forward. This is covenant of life. It's winning, it's influence, it's It's establishment. Ezekiel chapter 2 and verse 2. We are still in the atmosphere of worship. Ezekiel chapter 2 and verse 2. You know by now that worship is a system in God. He enables us to download realities into our places and then prayer stretches those things into our spaces. Are you following? Ezekiel 2 2. Uh, we start from verse 1 just for a comprehension of the reality. Are we all together? One to go, everyone. He says, and he said unto me, uh huh, son of man, are you there with me? Ezekiel chapter 2 and verse 1. Ezekiel chapter 2 and verse 1. Are we all together? And he said unto me, uh huh, son of man, come on. He says, stand, is that there? Upon thy feet, and I will speak unto thee. Verse 2, everybody, please read with me. One to go. And the spirit entered into me. He enters into the systemic dimension of a man. It is not just the words you heard. It is not just the sounds that you recorded with your mind. It is that I was teaching in the morning and I told you men are systems. You have the symbolism of that as trees. Are you following? Yes. It says, and the spirit entered into me. Uh Uh-huh. And where he spake unto me and did what? Set me upon my feet that I heard him. That So God can speak and you will not hear the one that speaks. He says, son of man, stand upon. He didn't say stand on thy own feet. Stand upon thy feet. He begins to show you a system. God being the rock and the foundation. Stand upon. What you are standing on determines what you hear. It's not just what you see. There is a reason why the Spirit entered into me as a system. Not just the words I heard in the service. But then God looks at you sitting down under this atmosphere. And he begins to talk into the multifaceted dimensions of you. Begins to talk into the spiritual. Talks into While he's talking to you, he's talking to your wife in you. He's talking to four generations. While you are carrying the blessed word. Actually connecting the dot. You thought you were listening to a two-hour service. But then you are building out your future in eternity. The spirit enters into me. Holistic. I thought I was only listening for myself. So I could be better. But God said you packed all your siblings with you. They didn't follow you. But I'm going to do something very soon. That will cause a change. And then they will still end up following you. Because what I will do through you. When you get back. We cause them to ask. Where comes this? The spirit entered me. 
words change men. It's from the concept information. It is in plus formation. Words don't form outside you. Words form inside you. When people that love you tell you you're beautiful, you can act like it doesn't matter, but you want to go see yourself in the mirror. You see yourself in the light you never thought. If someone tells you, I just like your eyes. There has been something you have not known about your eyes. You did health education, primary school. You did biology, secondary school. Now, it's telling you your eyes are like the flint of the... You know how brothers can be. And then you, it's, it enters you and then you think how you look is the secret to beauty. And then a man tells you you are good for nothing. And that man is your supposed husband. And then you lose your esteem. Prophecies are vehicles, but the voice of God is so powerful. The one that is speaking is what validates the words that are spoken. You can't separate a man from his words. It's the definition of holiness. Being holistic in words and in deeds. Say God is able to exceedingly abundantly all that men ask with their mouth and think. God says these are holistic people. And I look out for the terminology whole from the perspective words. I want you to pray one minute and say, Lord, the spirit that will enter me for the words that you have spoken to me, I receive the capacity to stand and I stand well upon the foundation this morning. The spirit, there is something called the spirit of establishment. It works with the covenant. It is not just only gifts that have spirit. Spirit of prophecy so is not only those things that have spirit. Everything you see operating the life of a man with the pact covenant have spirits that power them. I have told you over and over, it's not just the Holy Ghost that makes the manifestations that we see in the life of supposed believers that are excellent. There be many spirits and the intertwining of many spirits working all hand in hand. The Holy Ghost is the governor of that realm. I've come for spirit impartation today. I've come for spirit impartation. That spirit enter me. I have gone here and there and I have carried gifts and graces and dimensions, but I've come to carry the spirit on high. Apostle James began to reveal to us and he communicated, he said, a body without the spirit is dead. A body of two adults without the spirit is already dead marriage. A body of Two adults in business partnership is already a dead business before you begin. That spirits need bodies to find expression. Bodies are made for spirits to find expression. Having done all that I know how to do, I stand. I stand. I stand. I stand. God said, stand upon your feet. But I am finding out, while he said that, God didn't ask me to do it without him. You have been standing from the standpoint of human capacity and flesh. God said, stand. But he waits for you. Because the anointing follows the word. Say, to be right. And then I have learned as a student of the school of the spirit, not to lift myself. I stayed there till I see perpetually the hand of God. And when Peter stretched out his hand to the man at the beautiful gate, and then... But I've said, start the lead, but I will not start until I see. There is a spirit component in potential. Ah. 
God is taking you through a series of spiritual empowerment. Be sensitive. You are doing business with spirit in their field. You are coming into a magnetic energy. It's like it's a realm, it's magnetic flows. South Pole, North. He said on Mount Zion, the side of the North. That is where the power of God is domiciled. South begins to depict the nature of man. Man, South. The Southern Pole is, 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 is the two poles that must come in contact if God will make man. It's true. Be sensitive. Somebody is remembering the many things that he keeps doing and then you are remembering the prophecy of the Lord is not by power, is not by might, but by my spirit that can enter man. Spirit do these things to us. Sometimes we take the credit and don't give it to them. But they laugh at us because the credence of the things that we do is at the very mercy of their manipulation. So they can walk away without you giving the credit because they know if you're going to do it again, they have to participate. And time will happen to men. The revelation of their contribution cannot be long covered. It's an advantage if you come into a body of knowledge and you are sensitive enough to know. I have come into this truth today. I know that spirits work with men. This is a body that I have prepared for you. A body as thou prepared. Where is the spirit? Lord, you called me a mighty prophet to nations. This is a body. I have prepared prophetically. Where is the spirit of the prophet? Much more than an importation. This is a participation. This is you standing before your maker. And you are telling the maker, make me. I have always done academics without an excellent spirit. I am bad. Having done all I know how to do. The results I produce still does not impress me. Lord, I study. But your word said study to show yourself approved. I have studied. I have done all I do in time. And there is still this bankruptcy that is not remedied for. But then there is a grace that abounds all to hold sufficiency with God. the strong grace of the prophetic coming upon Pastor Olumide. I had to say this. Be sensitive. Something is switching over. You are coming into a realm. I don't know if he has been praying for this for long, but it is coming into a realm of is 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 open high, open here, open mind. It's true. Mark my words. It's not an impartation. I'm saying it as my system of pact participation, and then commence the manifestation. Be sensitive. It's hovering like. Somebody just asked for it now and it's coming upon that one too. Just one person is a man. Just one person. Breathe on us again, Holy Spirit. Strong upon us, Holy Spirit. Like a ring of light, you begin to see it, that the prophecies hanging upon us can find full expression, Jesus. Zika Kostani, Salabrena Fanatua. Ziki Kapistani, Salabrena Kofifa. I'm seeing like it's a hole and it's been for I, I listen when I see these things he depicts God anointing a system of ordaining men into assignments but God is saying that that's one as you are used to seeing oil being poured upon you he takes the face of people one two three that person has seen Bishop David Uideko in a vision before Apostle Joshua Selma in a vision before but God is saying, I should say to that one, I'm healing you for the ministry I gave to you. 
There is a wound on your head I'm leading you. Be sensitive. There's an empowerment. There is a strong spirit in the house already. I've told you this is covenant of life. So be careful when I just come. I'm, I don't I don't do this by impulse. So don't wait till you see somebody flying before. It's not really action when I release my guys to work. It might be too late then. But it is true. There is such a healing grace strong. It's strong. God is healing. That person is even a prophet. I'm seeing a wound on the scalp, head, and the heart. And God is healing that now. He's in this room. I'm not talking online yet. In this room. Stand up across the fire. Jackie Kapi Castelli. Zelle Brenna Fee. Zelle Kibastelli. See. Jacques Tapa Varakatos Tapifa. Embra Zeki Spane Fenan. There is a lady that has a strong grace. Naturally, you have people like you generally. Something is leaving that lady to come of a man. A man has been having issues around his marita. Just just follow me. God is, is not from me. He's leaving that lady to come on that man. See this passion of light. And I'm asking in my spirit. And that man is going to come into a body of marital solution. You will be shocked before the end of this month. And legalize the operation at the count of three. In the name of Jesus. Touch whoever to touch whoever. In the name of the God of heaven. One, two, and three. Strong. Let something live from the depth of abundance as a grace. Inherent is on that one. It comes strange upon this young man. Is the ministry of the believers. Is a dispassion. I'm hearing the voice of someone. Someone is a lady covered her grace now. What God says to one, he says to all. May he happen to such an individual right in this room. God is collecting anomalies right before your eyes. I declare and decree by the God of heaven. Just be sensitive to me. Selabano Stefi, Zeleke Brahastena. Jacoke Bakastefi, Salabrane Kitoa. Embrazeki Kandestifa. Perastani Salafena, Jeka Koperasti Salafana, Perane Katuahe ST Salafis Tana, Jeka Krabisani Salina, Ella Piranos, Hefifa, Steni Balista, Zeki Kapikatu. Who is that person that saw the hand of God strong in the dimension of favor? I'm seeing two people now. One, one. Sometimes last year from around June, July, August, to September, October It was strong Naturally people were given to give it and it has ceased God is restoring that grace now The challenge is that the proceeds that came from there Were used for personal grand advisation And the scripture says it gives seed to the sower Whoever received the seed is a sower And I'm seeing that lady I declare and decree Whoever you dishonor by proximity That took the grace of favor away May God's hand come strong for restoration now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I declare and decree now, whatever it is in your life you don't have, is a spiritual component. It causes the proponent of your life to be efficient, the efficacy of your life to be active. It brings you to a point of efficiency. I declare by the God of heaven now, the right tools that you need for the next phase of life, let it be supplied now. By the ministry of the Spirit, I stretch my hand. In the name of the God that I serve, I administrate by the strength of heaven all of the graces, all of the dimensions, all of the operations. In the name of Jesus in heaven, may he come strong upon you. May he rest upon you suddenly. There are many dimensions and graces. There are possibilities that you are not in your life that you need to move forward. I render a sponsor by the help of the Spirit. I declare and decree now strength to your feeble spirit. May your spirit man sustain capacity to carry these things. Come into bodies of knowledge. Come into bodies of light. Come into capacity for association. Come into adequacy for relationship. Come into empowerment by the spirit. Let the gifts come alive again. Let the gifts come alive again. Let all of the talents be traded again with men. I speak life to your bosom now. In the name of Jesus, I speak life to your bosom now. I speak life to your bosom now. I strengthen your hands. Oh dear Jesus. I, 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 whoever it is that have their hands tied. And so they are involved with the work of your hands. And then nothing is working. I command by the God of heaven. I declare now let that one go. In the name of Jesus. The scripture said God will bless the work of your hands. I command a blessing upon those works. 
from this day, whatever place cause upon your hands, I declare now that the cross that carried the cross carries your cross. I stand by the cross this evening and I command and enforce the reality of the works of Christ manifested in your life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Stand up across the feet. Woo! Jesus. I declare and let every aborted vision in the spirit come back to life. The things that God communicated to you that you have given up on, I speak hope to your spirit, man. I declare that this vision is be perfect exactly as God communicated in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. The living God, the faithful God. You are the living God. an horticulture is just the hand but I'm trying so that you can understand the spiritual operation that I am seeing I am seeing like a, you know the soil that is used to plant in, in such is, is bad like that black soil God is spreading it upon a like a farmland and God is changing somebody's experience it will cause you to even leave the environment you are be sensitive to know that it was God that shifted you are transplanted your context never changed God did it just to change your environment Someone that's running away to a location. So that person said they mentioned my prayer. And God said I should tell the person, where you are now is not where you will stay. God will still take you away from there. to me online or wherever like not fall on anybody in this auditorium and then you look at your life and you are cheated that is it you are i don't know if it's an emotional cheat or financial cheat but you are cheated and then you've been crying the lord is remedying your deeds listen to my word god is not returning what you lost but is bringing a compensation as a person The only thing you will need is to heal up again and then you have the fortitude to trust. Are you with me at all now? You will not look at it, but it's the solution to the problem of God. Be sensitive. God is the living God. Oh, oh, oh. It's the living God. It's the living God. It was my response when I saw His majesty. It is true. And I kept hearing He punishes the reality of the person of God. Yes, that you are the living God. It is true, you are the faithful God. The faithful, you are the faithful.
The Lord spoke this to me in the beginning of this year. God, I, I refuse to communicate it. Listen, God is going to release prophetic giants in spheres of influence. He's ejecting them into the they need that advantage for revelation and inspiration. Be sensitive. God is. You might begin to see God's strong hand upon you in the area of the sensitive. I said that now because I saw something again. Listen to me carefully. I don't hear bad news, but then God is raising this giant so that they can understand. It's true that God likes to use David for the liar. Are you following? But the operation of the time that we are here. It would be giant to confront the situations that will come soon. Are you following me at all? I want you to be sensitive. For such a one, this, some of the symptoms is that God will tell you what He has said. If you start before, to shorten. And He wants to make you. He wants to build you. He wants to add energy to your energy. Add strength to your strength. He wants to. Are you following me at all now? It's not God's system to delay you. It's God's system to make you. Thank you, Father. Okay, fine. is strong like well, this this game that people play on the dashboard. You know that game like King, what is that game? Like a chess. I've seen an operation. A light is shining upon Kenya. Take note of my word. And God is saying this to me in this phrase, like the lions in the safari. Listen. The men under prophetic or men that have prophetic dealings and destinies that have been kept bound. Systems of men and this manipulation. God is intentional about them in this season, in that environment. God needs them to make a statement. It's not about them being ministry at all. God needs them to, he wants to say something with that thing that will happen to their life. Be sensitive. I said it because God wanted me to. I fear the Lord. I don't even do this. greatly blessed. To connect with the ministry and get more from Covenant of Life, follow us on Facebook at CL Blogs, Instagram CL underscore Blogs, and download our teachings on our website www.clblogs.org or bit.ly slash CL Messages or on Telegram with the link t.me slash Covenant of Life. For questions and inquiries, call 706-357-5521. We love and celebrate you.